Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Bedford High School's 135th commencement celebration for your class of 2020. And now let's welcome Superintendent of the Bedford City School District, Dr. Andrea Selico. Good evening, class of 2020, parents, guardians, staff, and members of the Board of Education. I am Andrea Selico, the proud superintendent of the Bedford City Schools, and I am here to welcome you to an anything but ordinary graduation ceremony. I'm grateful for this opportunity to congratulate you, the class of 2020. This class is like no other for so many reasons, most prominently that you are making history. You know how to overcome adversity, no matter the circumstances, and tonight is no exception. You have shown us that you are capable of anything, including being asked to adapt to one of the greatest accomplishments to date in your long, young lives. We are here tonight to celebrate, though not in the setting we initially planned, because we believe the work that you have done should be celebrated despite what is going on in the world around us. This commencement represents the work, grit, determination, and aspirations you have and will continue to possess no matter what path you choose. This evening would not be possible without the hard work of the high school administration, teachers, and support staff, and certainly without the organization of senior class advisor, Mrs. Brennan. There were many details that had to be accounted for, and we hope that you enjoy all the special touches we have in store for you. In closing, I wish you the best of luck. Know that you are loved and appreciated. Do great things, class of 2020. We are counting on you to make a difference in the world. Thank you. Please welcome your Bedford High School principal, Christopher Thompson. The Bedford High School class of 2020. Wow, you made it, but that was expected. I can't imagine right now what you are all thinking looking back over the last 12 years of your education. Starting in elementary school, moving on to intermediate and middle school, then of course coming to Bedford High School and being the small fish in the big ocean. But I'm sure that only lasted for maybe a couple hours or maybe a couple days with the class of 2020. You're leaving behind a great legacy at Bedford High School and within the Bedford community. Before I came to Bedford, I heard about the class of 2020. And everything that I've heard about this class has been true. You are very, very strong individually, but you are powerful as a collective group. This has been so evident to everyone during the school year, but especially during the last three months with the uncertainty, all the changes, as well as the many challenges that you have faced. You have been resilient, dedicated, and above all, you have kept your eyes on the prize. I would like to thank the parents and families of the class of 2020 for your dedication, support, and love. Sometimes it was tough love, but that is what has gotten them through. To the staff of Bedford City Schools, in particular to the staff at Bedford High School, your dedication is unmatched, your compassion your support and the love that you have shown these students will forever echo with them. I would like to say thank you to the staff here at Bedford High School for the amazing job that they've done in getting our students through that finish line. Your value cannot be measured. Know again that you've made a lasting impression on this class. And last but not least, to one of the greatest classes, if not the greatest senior class that has come 
through those doors and walk these halls at Bedford High, the class of 2020. This is your day. Today marks the day that you will all spread your wings and you will fly in different directions. Some of you will enter the workforce. Some of you have enlisted in the military. Some of you will travel. And some of you will explore colleges and universities throughout the United States. I do know this, that you are movers and shakers and doers. Think big, dream bigger and always remember that you have something that others do not. You have that Bearcat pride. I am proud of each and every one of you. And I wanna say thank you for the lessons that you have taught me as well as the staff here at Bedford High School. You have made Bedford a much better place and you have raised the bar for all of those that will follow in your footsteps. It has been my honor, and it is now a privilege for me to say congratulations to the class of 2020. Thank you. And now let's welcome President of the Bedford City Schools Board of Education, Phil Stevens. Good evening, parents, family members, friends, and graduates of 2020. This is truly a special day for you. This is the moment you have been waiting for, and I am very blessed and honored to share with you a few words of advice and how proud we are of your class. You have been the seniors to overcome and experience the worldwide COVID-19 pandemic. All of you adapted to the change within a short period of time, which you did not have much time to prepare, to prepare for, but you adapted and overcame it quickly. The world is dependent on you. Yes, class of 2020, your discipline, your dreams, and your goals are measured throughout the rest of your life. You are about to embark on a new journey. Keep the faith, Stay strong, stay positive, and surround yourself with positive people. Don't let anyone or anything bring you down from accomplishing your goals or for what you are passionate of. You will have adversity throughout this journey, but adversity is the way we learn and to grow and develop strength. In your careers, you will meet new people, travel, gain knowledge, and opportunities, which opportunities will come and go. It is up to you to decide what's best in your life. As I close, to the senior class of 2020, your journey is waiting for you. The future is in your hands. Go out and make a difference. We are wishing you much success, soar high, Keep God first in your life. Stay prayerful, and God bless you. Thank you, and have a blessed day. It is my pleasure to introduce to you our first student speaker of the night. First is Senior Class Secretary, Anya Van Huffel Goodlock, daughter of Tibor and Catherine Goodlock of Bedford. Anya is planning to attend the University of Chicago where she will major in biology on a pre-med track. She has been awarded nearly a quarter of a million dollars. I'll repeat that, nearly a quarter of a million dollars in scholarships and grants. Let's welcome Anya. Good evening, ladies, gentlemen, and individuals. It is my honor to be standing here virtually before you tonight. But before I begin, moms and dads, brothers and sisters, aunts and uncles, grandparents and teachers, let's all give the graduating class of 2020 
another round of applause. <laughs> Truthfully, this is a bit weird for me as I don't know if I've just cut off your clapping or if you all have been sitting in awkward silence or if you just laughed at my lame joke. But wow, seriously, what a last three months, huh? COVID-19, school closing, graduation being virtual, prom, it's really shocking. But the quick response and support has been astounding and just goes to show that when things get tough, Bedford gets tougher. Our educational staff, especially our teachers, have been doing amazing. Let's give them a round of applause. Let's see. So, class of 2020, here we are. Today, we are seniors, yesterday we were freshmen, and tomorrow we will be the leaders of our world. So, to the upperclassmen who tried so desperately to convince us that there was a third floor or that our first year English course was in the basement, you almost had us, I must admit, but we've learned since then. From our first football game and halftime show, where even though we were nervous, we didn't fall. From our first pep rally and homecoming, where we realized that high school parties were still held in cafeterias. From our first serious finals week, only to realize this would be one of many. It was a combination of these firsts that succeeded in preparing us for the next step. So when it came to pre-calc and chemistry homework, we pushed past it, to suffering from writer's block on a research paper. We overcame that, to taking standardized tests. We did pretty well. And then came the hard stuff, like applying to college and trade schools, or talking to military recruiters, or looking for jobs, to realizing that, hey, we're seniors now, and having to battle the ultimate enemy, senioritis. And battle it we did. You know, as a little girl, I dreamed of graduating from high school. I dreamed of going on to college and becoming a doctor. Kind of a weird goal for a nine-year-old, I must admit. But hey, that was me. So to my mom and dad who helped support those dreams of mine, thank you. To the powerful and inspirational adults I've met, especially Maya, my second mom, thank you. And to the class of 2020, thank you. We have done something truly fantastic. We have focused, we have worked hard, we have done what we needed to do, and finally, we have graduated. So give yourself a pat on the back for everything that you've done and everything that you'll continue to do. It's seriously amazing. On this day, we finished taking our first step to achieving our dreams. We are all now one step closer to owning that salon or that auto shop, to becoming architects and engineers, to um, serving our country and rising in the ranks to becoming lawyers and doctors, to having our own places and our own families, to becoming successful adults. People always told me that these four years would be memories and experiences that I would cherish for a lifetime. And it's true, I will hold these memories in my heart and think back to them for a very long time. High school was not a smooth ride, but we made it through anyway. So today, I seriously want you to be proud of yourself. What you have done is impressive. Don't let anybody or anything get you down, because from today on, you own this world. So let's get out there and do wonderful, fantastic things. Before I end, I would like to give special thanks to my favorite teachers who made a true impact on my life. Mrs. Keister, Mr. Brown, Mrs. Brennan, Mr. Nichols, Mrs. Schof, Mr. Zerke, Mrs. Wentz, and Mrs. Spate. And also, as promised, a huge shout out to the Bedford Band. Without you guys, I have no idea what high school would have been like. Thank you, and once again, congratulations to the graduating class of 2020. Thank you, Anya, for those inspiring words. We wish you all the best in your future endeavors. Next is senior class president, Anijah Slaughter. Anijah is the daughter of Ricardo and Bianca Slaughter of Bedford Heights. Anijah is planning to attend the University of Cincinnati where she will be majoring in nursing. Additionally, Anijah has been awarded $121,000 in scholarships equivalent to a full ride. After her address, Anijah will present the senior class gift to Superintendent Andrea Selico. Welcome, Anijah. Good evening, students, staff, family, and friends. I'm Anijah Slaughter, your proud class president. 
I've been waiting to deliver our commencement speech since my first day of high school back in August of 2016. Never would have imagined then that I would now be pre-recording graduation to view at a drive-in movie theater. However, life is unpredictable, but just know in lieu of everything that is going on right now, that life always has a way of working itself out in due time. Let me start off by announcing how proud I am of each and every one of you. As a class, we have been through a lot over the past years, yet we have still made it to this moment. Graduating is a milestone for us all. I want to especially recognize those of you who are the first in your families to graduate high school, and those of you who found, who found a way to persevere and make it to the finish line in spite of the odds that were stacked against you. If there's one thing that I know about Bedford High's class of 2020, it is that we are one resilient class who embodies grit and determination. With that being said, I have no doubt that we will all be successful in our future endeavors. I feel that our time here at Bedford High has definitely built character and molded us to be the well-rounded people that we are today. Speaking for myself, my high school experience gave me insight on who I am, what I am capable of, and who I want to be in the future. I would like to thank the parents, teachers, and students of Bedford High for making my past four years amazing. You all have played a crucial role in my coming of age, and for that, I will forever be grateful. I'm almost certain that my fellow classmates share the same sentiment. I can confidently say that our class will be remembered for many years to come. I felt this way even before COVID-19 made our class famous. We are a class full of powerful change makers who have influenced the Bedford City School District in a multitude of ways. It's for this reason that I feel so honored to be our class president. Together, we have accomplished so many great things. And I mean, not to toot our own horn, but the proof is in the pudding. What other class has won the Spirit Shield two consecutive years in a row? What other class has crippled dress code and fought for us to be able to wear hoodies all in the same year? And tell me, what other class has finished their senior year of high school and graduated during a global pandemic? Yes, I'll wait. We are that class, the class of 2020. We are the first of many the first class of the decade and the first in Bedford's history to have a drive-in graduation. Congratulations to the pioneers who are the historical class of 2020. I hope you enjoy our movie starring us. On behalf of the class of 2020, please accept this donation to the One for Our Student Scholarship Fund, which was started six years ago to recognize the students who embody the best of what BHS has to offer. This year's recipients were Anya Van Huffel Gutlock and India Matthews. Please accept this gift on behalf of the class of 2020. Thank you. Thank you, Anijah. We greatly appreciate your generosity and thank you to the class of 2020. Thank you, students. You represent what is best about the youth of today. And we are thankful for your leadership in the class of 2020. Board President Stevens, Superintendent Selico, the students receiving a Bedford High School diploma tonight have completed the course of study prescribed by the Bedford Board of Education for the Bedford High School, classed as first grade and accredited, and is therefore awarded this diploma given from Bedford, Ohio on May 27, 2020. And now, the class of 2020. Jose Maria Acosta. Zaria Adams. Cameron Allen. Laura Askew. Amari Adkins. Nicholas Atkins, Ashley Austin, Marvin Bagley Jr., Alexis Barnes, Jayla Barnes, Jasmine Barnwell. Owen Barzell.
Jalen Baxter, Sarah Beth Begg, Jayla Bell, Toran Bell Jr., Ariel Bennett. Andre Bethea Jr. Bria Billings Fitzgerald. Bernard Blue Jr. Thailand Brazil. Jada Brewster. Brandon Briggs, Samira Brown, Kayla Burton, and Custo Butler the Third. Jayshon. Callaway, Eric Caparelli, Joe Caparelli, Melvin Carter the Third, Thomas Cashman. Sharia Churn, Sandra Cisneros Cabrera, Marcus Cloud, Dakota Coleman. Kennedy Copeland, okay. Aliyah Cortland, Jayla Daly, Deshaun. Dash Marlon Davis Wesleyan Davis Sarah Davison Chase Deloach, Tyreek DeRowan, Drayshawn Dixon, Precious Duncan, Tierra Dunnikin. Mina Edge, Christopher Edmonds Hall, Jr., Chris Edwards, Joshua Edwards. Brandice Evans. Woo! 
Joshua Evans. Shabriana Fodzel. Alex Fields. Jalen Foster. Joshua Fouché. Javon Franklin. Katherine Garbrick. <laughs> India Gardner. <laughs> Kayla Garner. <laughs> Shantia Gary. <laughs> Victoria. Gonzalez, Madison Greer, Angel Griffin, Mario Gross Jr. Tyshawn Hall. Marcel Hampton Jr. Tania Hayes. Devin Hibbett. Robert Hicks. Kayla Hill. Mark Hood Jr. Maya Hooks. Mark Howard. Vanessa Howard. Lorelai Hudak. Sierra Hudson. Jays Hudson. Camille Hughes. Adam Incarnado. Cameron Jackson. Cassidy Jackson. DeShayla Jackson. James Jackson. Jamiana Jackson. Micaiah Jackson. Right. 
Rodney Jackson. Are you guys ready for phone? Shania Jackson. Shania Jeffrey. Elijah Jeffries. Thomas H. Jeffries the fifth. Ajane Johnson. Brandon Johnson. Jada Johnson. Jamie Johnson. Stacy Johnson. Tori Johnson. Ian Jones. Kaya Jones. Colin Kennedy. Johnico Knight. Yolanda Lavender. Katarius Lee. Ryan Lamasters. Congratulations. Thank you. Bria Leverett. Noah Lennon. Hunter Long. Jaden Lowe. Cameron Lucky. Jerome Luster the third. Destiny Macklin Robinson. Aaron Magic. Kylan Maloney. Jalen Marbury. Woo! 
Devana Marcus. India Matthews. Reese Mattis. Kyla McCall. Karina McMullen. Anthony Merritt Jr. Rene Merritt. Elijah Middlebrooks. <laughs> Alexis Miller. <laughs> Brayon Miller. Rain Miller. <laughs> Beverly Mills. Sherell Mitchell. Luke Manaski. Antonio Moore. Marquise Moore. Ready? Daniel Morgan, Jr. Venicia Morris. <laughs> Tanija Moten. <laughs> Miracle Nabeshi. Caitlin Nelson. Christian Palomino Villanueva. Amaya Parker. Jada Parker.
Michael Parker. Lachelle Patterson. Jasmine Peterson. Joshua Petit. Jaira Petit. Jaden Phelps. Noah Phillips. Janice Philpot. Olivia Plisky. Nevea Rand. Najante Randall. Dynasty Reed. Renique Roden. Deandra Raylise Richardson. William Rist. Angel Rista. Daniel Romero. Hector Rosario. Austin Rao. Celeste Sanders. Nicholas Schroeder. Elijah Simpson. Darnell Sims. Aaron Singleton. Sarah Skazenta. Anija Slaughter. Vertario Smith Lowry. Justin Sneed. Alicia Solta. <laughs> T. 
Tessa Soltis. Ashley Spates. William Spates the Fourth. Ivory Stanton. Sage Stevens. Brendan Stewart. Shamar Stewart. Danielle Stokes. Madison Stover. Bruson Streeter. Jameer Sullivan. Antonio Taylor. Joshua Terry. Haley Thomas. Jamil Thomas. Khalil Thomas. Kyrie Thomas. Mia Thomas. Maya Thomas. Romello Tompkins. Spencer Tui. William Tubbs the Third. Inaya Turner. Matthew Twit. Brianna Underwood. Anya Van Huffel Goodlock. Savannah Vertoshnik. Jamira Watkins. Ariana White. Jordan Whitaker. Rufus Williams the Fourth. Taylor Williams. Jawan Willis. Woo! 
Jayla Wilson. Henry Woodard the Fourth. Council Wright Jr. Madison Wright. Samaja Young. Marissa Zenda. Congratulations, class of 2020. Please hold your tassel and move it from the right to the left. You are now official graduates of the class of 2020. Good luck and much happiness to you wherever you may go and whatever you may do. Thank you for attending the 135th Bedford High School Commencement Celebration. Let's give one last farewell to our class, our graduated class of 2020. Let's go Bearcats!